What would you do if a serial killer promised to spare you if you played jazz? In 1918, the Axemen of New Orleans sent a chilling letter to the city, declaring his love for jazz music and threatening to kill anyone who didn't engage in a late night jam session. This unidentified figure was responsible for a series of gruesome murders, striking fear into the hearts of residents. His method was brutal, attacking victims with an ax, often in their own homes. The police were baffled and panic spread through the vibrant, jazz-infused streets of the city. The Axeman's reign of terror was not just marked by his violent acts, but also by the eerie way he connected his killings to the rhythms of New Orleans jazz. On the night he struck, neighbors reported hearing the sounds of music echoing through the streets. The Axeman's cryptic letter urged jazz musicians to keep playing, claiming he would spare them, but only if they played his favorite tunes. His existence remains a mystery, leaving people to wonder, was he a ghost, a man, or something far more sinister? To this day, the Axeman's identity and motives remain unsolved, forever haunting the melodies of New Orleans.